हॅलो एव्हरी वन माय सेल्फ लेक्चरर मिस अदिती अनिल कुशारे मास्टर ऑफ फार्मसी इन क्वालिटी अशुरन्स टेक्निक्स फ्रॉम के के वाघ इन्स्टिट्यूट ऑफ फार्मसी चांदोरी नाशिक टुडे वी आर गोईंग टू डिस्कस अबाउट द टॉपिक फॉर्म्युलेशन मेथड्स फॉर सस्पेन्शन फ्रॉम फार्मास्युटिक्स टू फॉर्म्युलेशन मेथड्स फॉर सस्पेन्शन द टॉपिक्स टू बी कवर्ड आर ॲज फॉलोज introduction to suspension as a biphasic liquid dosage form and formulation methods for suspension introduction a pharmaceutical suspension is a dispersed system in which internal phase is dispersed uniformly as a finely divided insoluble particles throughout the external phase the internal phase consisting of insoluble solid particles having a specific range of size which is maintained uniformly throughout the suspending vehicle with aid of single or combination of suspending agent the external phase that is a suspending medium is generally aqueous in some instance it may be an organic or oily liquid for non oral use formulation of suspensions the three steps that can be taken to ensure formulation of an elegant pharmaceutical suspension are control particles size on a small scale this can be done using a mortar and a pestle to grind down ingredients to a fine powder then use the thickening agent to increase the viscosity of the vehicle by using suspending agents or viscosity increasing agents and third use of wetting agent oblique surfactants formulation methods for suspension suspension containing diffusible solid second suspension containing indiffusible solids third one suspension containing poorly wettable solids and fourth suspension produced by chemical reaction so let's see about first suspension containing diffusible solids some insoluble solids are light and easily wettable on the reason on that reason they readily mix with the water and on shaking diffuse through the liquid for long enough to ensure even distribution in each dose such substances are known as diffusible or dispersible solids list of diffusible solids commonly used in oral preparations are calcium carbonate as an antacid light kaolin is used in treatment of diarrhea light magnesium carbonate used as a laxative magnesium trisilicate as an antacid and rhubarb powder in the digestive problems method of preparation finely powder take insoluble powder in a mortar add sufficient vehicle to produce smooth paste add any non non volatile solid ingredients in a part of the vehicle and mix well then add any volatile solid ingredients previously dissolved in some of the vehicle and mix well and then add any liquid ingredients rinse the water and paste with the successive volume of vehicle until they are quite clean transferring the rinsing to the bottle make up the volume with the vehicle and shake thoroughly container and storage dispensed medicines that is mixture lotion etc thick container with wide mouth store in a cool place very low temperature may cause suspended particles to aggregated suspension containing indiffusible solids indiffusible particles will not disturbed in a vehicle long enough so that the correcting this problem is to increases viscosity of the vehicle by adding a thickening agent used internally indiffusible solids aspirin in fever and pain chalk as antacid phenobarbital sedative sulfadimidin as a chalmedia used externally in diffusible solids calamine in the pain and itching hydrocortisone in inflammation sulfur as a antibacterial and zinc oxide in irritation tragacan powder mainly used suspending agent for that type of preparation tragacan powder is used in the ratio of 2 g per 100 ml of the suspension and tragacan mucilage it is used in the ratio of 1/4 of the volume of the suspension tragacan mucilage is used only when the vehicle is a chloroform water or a water 
because if it added to the preparations containing a medicinally active vehicle the mucilage replaced medicinally active vehicle thereby decreasing their activity in such cases the tragacanth powder must be used as a suspending agent method of preparation finely powder the indefusible solid particles take in a mortar add any diffusible or soluble solids then add tragacanth powder or mucilage and mix thoroughly if only indefusible substance is to be incorporated mix it with tragacanth powder in a mortar add sufficient vehicle to produce this smooth cream and after that then add more vehicle to make up the vo final volume suspension containing poorly wettable solids some substance for an example sulfur and hydrocortisone are both insoluble in water and poorly wetted by it these are those are produced clumps and it is difficult to disperse in aqueous liquids also produce foam on shaking because it is stabilized by the film of unwettable solid at the liquid or air interface on that reason added satisfactory wetting agent those must be reduced the interfacial energy between the solid and liquid those agents adsorbed at the solid or liquid interface in such a way that the affinity of the particles for the surrounding medium is increased while the interparticular forces are decreased for an example alcohol in tragacanth then mucilage glycerin and glycol in sodium alginate quilaria extracts have been used in a sulfur lotion etc suspension produced by chemical reaction chemical reaction method are used to produce insoluble active constituents in the lotion in that method the highly diluted solutions of the reacting substance are mixed together so as to form very finely divided precipitates that can be easily distributed throughout the liquid on shaking precipitates so formed are generally diffusible in nature therefore no need any suspending agent zinc sulfide lotion bpc british pharmaceutical codex produced by this method so what we learned from this formulation methods of for suspension the learning outcomes are what is suspension as a biphasic liquid dosage form and formulation methods for suspension thank you